Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com coming at you with a eight-box jumbo break of the brand-new 2018 Topps Chrome Baseball. Nice. Pick your team number one from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Big thanks to everybody who got into the action. Chris Nelson, last spot mojo. Adam Kupperman getting the Angels in the spot random. And Patrick Kay getting the Yankees in the spot random. With He got last spot mojo in the spot random, too. So you got double mojo up in this, and there's everybody else right here. Thanks, everyone. Thanks for joining. Thanks for filling up those spot randoms. Remember, this is also a Dog Days of Summer promo spot, so at the end of the break, I'll randomize all those names there. And the name on top gets into the big list of names that can try to win a bunch of break credit and possibly a case of football cards. So check it out. All the details are on jazbeeshobbyland.com. <laughs> look, look at that guy. That was not intentional. I could pop open that case a hundred times and I would never do that again. I would never be able to replicate that moment. All right, here we go. So these jumbos right here have five chrome autographs per box. There's Otani on the front right there. I'm assuming Vet Base does not ship in this. Yeah, no Vet Base ships, but all RCs, all rookie cards, inserts, variations, and obviously the hits, the autographs will ship. All right, good luck. Good luck, everyone. I think we've, have we done at least one of every new release? I think we have. Nice. Nice, thanks everybody. Makes me happy. On a new release night. Oh no, we still need to do Leaf Greatest Hits Basketball. Oh, we gotta do that. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, let's do this break, and then let's work. I think the next Premier Hockey is going to go off. And uh, let's try to do a Leaf Greatest Hits basketball before the end of the night. So then we can say we did one of every new release. Good luck, everybody. Box number one about to happen. We always have a lot of fun with this Topps Chrome Baseball from year to year. So thanks for joining it. Good luck. There we go. So we'll breeze through these cards right here. Obviously, stuff like that will ship. Stuff like that will ship. Those are all the inserts. Stuff like the Greg Bird that won't ship. Everything with the RC will ship. Obviously, stuff like that will ship. And Chris Stratton will ship. It's our first autograph out of this break. That'll be for Jonah and the Giants. A little Oppo Joe Mojo. It's got his Twitter handle right there, too. Justin Turner should be off the DL. This weekend, I think. Nice Carlos Correa. And Chance Cisco, another orange team with an autograph. That goes to Jared and the O's. Nice Otani. That's pretty cool. We'll save one of those. I'm sure those have a bit of value there. And there's Jacob Barnes. For the Brew Crew, who were beating the Dodgers 2-0, but then the Dodgers came back. A couple solo shots. Grandal and Dozier. New Dodger. 
tying it up at twos. That Brew Crew autograph will go to Ryan Hack. Yeah, the autos do look pretty clean on that surface, Patrick Goodwin. I agree. Looking pretty good. Eugenio Suarez Blue, that's out of 150. And these will be top loaded before they, they ship out, of course, as always. A different Otani, I think it's the same Otani. Oh, Anthony Stantner, another orange team. And there's Tiago Vieira for the White Sox. That's your fifth auto out of this box. Nice. And then Irwin Santana. Irvin Irwin? Irvin Santana, 299. Where did I get Irwin? And that, of course, goes to Ryan Redman and the Twins. There are your autos. Next box. Good luck. It's kind of warm in here. Our thermostat, after, after the great air conditioning saga of 2018 here at Jaspi's Hobbyland, the thermostat now resets itself to like 75 degrees like every once in a while. Terrible. It's got to be high 60s in here. Otherwise, the studio light here it gets way too hot. All right, next box. Uh, did I have any picks? I did have picks today. How are my picks doing? I picked the Angels. How are the Angels doing right now? Angels lost. Great. What about Miami? Miami postponed. All right. We got... What about Kansas City? Okay, they won. That's good. It's one win today. Uh, what about the Rockies? Rockies are down by one at the top of the eighth in St. Louis. All right. So there you go. Yeah, 75 is, is, is toasty, Curtis. Oh, yeah, I'll bet it's Nightbot cranking up the heat. Yeah, 75, that's like, that's like, that puts me on the snooze cruise, especially 75 in, indoors. And with the studio light, that probably adds like 5 to 10 degrees in this little room, in this little studio that we have here. Don't don't temperature shame me, Curtis. Don't temperature shame me. All right. Next box. Carlos Correa, not numbered, but a nice parallel. JD Davis. Rookie auto for Jared and the Astros. 70, uh, 74? No, 45 out of 250. Can't read. There's Michael Fulmer, Blue Wave to 75. There's Max Freed for the Brave. That goes to Patrick K. It probably is, William. 
there's probably like no one I don't think there's I think there's some red there's some residences on the other side but I think in the office building area most people are are not working right now all right max Reed for the brave that goes to Patrick K and Brent was asking earlier I think that's a good question. With all the brands, variation products, what would you consider a true rookie for baseball? What would everyone consider a true rookie for baseball? To me, I feel like Bowman baseball would be would be one of the ones where I would say I would want to get the earliest out of the prospects, but I guess after that, once they're major leaguers, that's a good question. Maybe sets like this, Topps Chrome Baseball. That goes to uh, Chris Rowe in the National. What, what does everyone else think? Patrick and Rich saying tops chrome. See, I would think that it would be Bowman chrome, but but I realize that they're just they're still prospects. Then they're still like a few years out, right, from becoming a. A major leaguer. There's Joey Votto for the red legs. I'm going to put these right over here. So initially I thought, oh, it would be, you know, it would be, uh, there's Jordan Luplo. Didn't he, isn't he called up already? So initially I thought Bowman, but there's still prospects there. They're not quite big leaguers yet. But yeah, the, I mean, the, the Bowman technically does have the best value. But if you're talking about a rookie card once they're major leaguers, yeah, technically it would be anything with RC on it, Curtis. You're absolutely right. But I don't know. I think some people consider some quote-unquote true rookies as opposed to the others. Redemption coming up. And I think Topps Chrome, yeah, probably is one of the more popular sets. You know, where you would want to get that proper rookie. There's the Zach Granite parallel. All right, behind Future Stars, Alex Bregman is rookie autograph purple, refractor parallel of... W, I, Willie, Willie Calhoun, no, Willie, Willie Adams. Isn't that what, uh, what Ray's fan, was? isn't that what Owen was looking for? He's a Ray, right? There you go. There you go, Rays fan. There he is. Nice one, Owen. So there are your five autographs there. All right, next box. All right, so final scores. Well, Miami and Atlanta were postponed. Final scores, Royals beat the White Sox 10-5. Rays beat the Angels 7-2. Cubbies over the Pirates 9-2. Uh, Astros over the Mariners 8-3 in Seattle. In Oakland 8-3, A's over the Blue Jays. Tigers 7-4 over the Reds. Indians shutting out Minnesota at home in Minnesota, 2 0. The Orioles edging out the Yankees, 7 5. Nats beating the Mets, 5 3. And only two games in progress. The uh, Dodgers and Bre uh, Brewers are tied at two in the top of the sixth. And in the bottom of the eighth, 
the Cardinals holding on to a 3-2 lead. All right. Next box. Good luck, everybody. William Fulmer, what's going on? Oh, what's that? That is a Chris Bryant rookie debut relic. That's pretty cool. Oh, J Jacob was attached to that. Rookie debut medallion card. Nice one, Eric, with the Cubs. Yeah, is that a case hit? Oh, that is the case hit, says Patrick. Hey, there you go. Nice. It's one per case. There's Tanner Scott. That's her first autograph out of there. Uh, William Fulmer, no national. No, we're at the national right now. Don't you see? It's crazy here at the national. Out of four ninety nine. You're welcome, EA. Seems like it, Eric Jennings. I should I should be putting. I think the the Orioles are often. Uh, that's out of nine. Oh, I think the Orioles are over like plus three hundred. I should have taken the O's. Today's for entertainment only picks. For the Cardinals, there's Breivik Valera. No, yeah, William Fulmer. No national for us this year, I'm afraid. Shooting for next year, though. Just a lot going on. We just weren't able to uh, able to make it, make the timing work. There's Roddy Reed. We can just pretend we're at the National. Like there's, like we're in a private area of the National, <laughs> special area. Rowdy Reed for Chris Rowe and the Nationals. Rory, what's going on? Any big hits today? Yeah. Big hits all day, every day. What were some of the big hits we got today? Are they still having internet issues out there, Rich? I don't even know if people are still on air right now from the National. Any guesses on that redemption? Nice Otani. As long as we'll be there in, in 2020. I mean, probably, but nice. Miguel Andujar. He's bringing back the, uh, the slashes through his name, which I like. Nice one for the Yankees. Patrick Kay, who got the Yankees in a spot random. And look at this. Another one for the Yankees. Printing plate. Gary Sanchez. Nice. Patrick Kay, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. And there's Scott Kingery. Upside down Scott Kingery reveals. Rookie autograph of... Not Willie Adams again. Wa Wa Walker, Walker, Texas Bueller? Walker Walker Bueller. And do we, why is he not signing his cards? He usually signs. He's usually good about signing. Maybe he got busy. All right, that goes to my Dodgers Brita with my Dodgers. 
And I guess he had he had time to do the other new release, the non tops new release. Didn't have time for tops. Come on, Walker Bueller. All right, nice box. <laughs> oh, come on, Arthur. Typical lazy Dodger. Unbelievable. He signed in the other the other new release today. Well, we got a one on one Walker Bueller, Rory. A live hit out of uh, Immaculate. That was nice. I don't know. There was just a lot. Just watch the watch all the videos, Rory. It's worth it. Burba personal boxes later. Personal boxes never. We don't do personal boxes here. I'm afraid. I guess you could buy out a break. If all the spots are remaining, you could buy out a break, and that'll be a personal box. Of <laughs> course, like, ain't nobody got time for that. Yeah, uh, Ray oh, yeah, there's a Cal Ripken one out of five autograph, the one of one Rafael Devers printing plate autograph, on plate auto, and patch. Um, what else? I just saw that, Eric Jennings. Nice. He was busy in a, what's that, Digital Underground, I think? All right, next box. Good luck. We got Taiwan Walker, Texas Ranger, 25 out of 75. For the Snakes, that'll be for Michael K. The Diamondbacks. And we've got a nice uh, Tyron Guerrero. Nice. That's 37 out of 50. A nice looking one for the Marlins. Jeremy, Jeremy Tillman, JT, for the Marlins. I am not Rory. Tell me what's going. On. I know. I know the Dodgers tied it up. I'm. I'm. I'm watching it in the sense that I'm watching it on MLB Game Day. Does that count? I forgot to pull up a stream. There's Victor Arano for the Phillies. That'll be going to DMAC. So we got three more autos to go. Kind of like those old uniforms there. There's Troy Scribner. Troy Scribner with the Angels. That goes to Adam Kupperman. Two and two to Manny Machado with a man on. No outs. Let's go. Let's let's chase Chase Anderson out of this game. The big hit. There's Kenta Maeda out of 299 for the Dodgers. And I almost missed that. Come on, Richard Urena. Maybe move the auto up a little bit. I almost missed that. That goes to the Toronto Blue Jays. That goes to Rick T and the Bluebirds. Eric Jennings saying the worst uniforms ever were the Back to the Future uniforms of the Mariners. Yeah, those Back to the Future uniforms are pretty bad. Yeah. 
And we've got Reyes Moronta. Blue Shimmer autograph for the Giants. Gigantes. That goes to Jonah with the Giants. Out of 150. So that's all five of our autographs right there. Excellent. Nice Encarnacion. And a Chris Bryant back there. Excellent. Halfway through with this eight box break, ladies and gentlemen. And that would be Jonah with the Giants. All right. Good luck, everybody. Oh, Machado walks. Matt Kemp. Oh, first pitch line out to shortstop Herman, Hernan Perez. Come on. Eric Jennings, how about Joe Simpson's old man rant over the weekend? Oh, yeah, I kind of heard about that. Um, was that the Chase Utley thing, Eric Jennings? Are we thinking about are we talking about the same thing? Oh, it was. It was. I think he was specifically talking about Chase Utley. Um yeah, how the Dodgers were dressed during during batting practice, but I think he was specifically addressing Chase Utley, who was not wearing a proper uniform or whatever during batting practice. But it was just, this was like the pre-workout before the actual batting practice or something like that, which I thought was weird. But they specifically wanted to highlight that. But I think this was before the fans even showed up for the actual batting practice. There's Ian Happ to 99, which I thought was weird. I think he's an old Dodger, too. It was just like Walter Olson will be rolling in his grave and blah, 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 blah. And I was like, come on, man. <laughs> nice Jack Flaherty, rookie auto for the Cardinals. That goes to Jeremy Tillman. And it was like a Beat Cancer t-shirt or something like that. I mean, I'll let that t-shirt slide. <laughs> There's Hunter Wood. You should probably worry about Ball players with uh, <laughs> ball players and uh, the bad tweets on his team. You know, maybe he should worry about what Sean Newcomb's saying, rather what rather than what the Dodgers are wearing. Maybe he should worry about, uh, you know, baseball players and domestic violence issues before he worries about what guys are wearing during batting practice or like pre-batting practice. There's Garrett Cooper. Nice Garrett Cooper autograph. All right, see you, Rory. That's out of 150 for the Marlins. That's another one for JT and the Marlins. Nice Chris Taylor. It's Chase. No, we're at the Nationals right now. What are you talking about? And there's Guerrero again, another Marlin. For JT.
Should be expecting one more auto out of there here. Trevor Williams, there it is. All right, ladies and gentlemen, three more boxes to go. What was everyone's uh, favorite trade, ladies and gentlemen? Big deadline deal trade, or, or now that the trade window is over, what was everyone's? Who who do you think improved the most? Now, I, I don't mind the Dodgers picking up Machado at all, obviously, or Brian Dozier. Kind of wish they picked up a little pitching, though. I think um, I would have liked to see... Chris Archer to the Pirates was, a, was an interesting one. Chase, you like Cole Hamels for the Cubs? That was a solid deal. That's just... That's just replacing you, Darvish, basically, right? Eric, your least favorite was the Moose trade. You're a Royals guy. I mean, that's that was kind of inevitable, though, wasn't it? I don't know. Rory wasn't too happy about the. Uh, Rory wasn't too happy about that. About that uh, Jonathan Scope trade. What does everyone think about the Scope trade? Oh, Escobar to the Diamondbacks. First place Diamondbacks. Arthur, you, you and Joe P were awfully quiet when the Dodgers were, were chasing the Diamondbacks. They were ahead 10 games. They blew a 10-game lead. But now, after what, a, a half a game ahead? Now they're crowing about Diamondbacks being first place again. Hmm. Interesting. Tiago Vieira. White Sox. That goes to Michael K. Um, in, injuries. No, oh, you guys would never let me use that excuse. No way. Injuries. Yeah, everyone has injuries. Dodgers were injured too when they when they were ten games back, and I was like, injuries, you guys. Justin Turner's injured. Kershaw's out, and then. I got garbage, quote garbage from Joe P. P F F F F F T from Arthur. Behind Buster Posey, you are due to receive rookie autograph refractor parallel of W A Walker, Walker Bueller. Sign your cards, Walker. Another one for Brita and the Dodgers. He signed he signed in Panini. Well, everyone can use pitching, Joe P. You guys short up the pitching as well. Everyone needs pitching. You can always add more. Even as great as the Dodgers staff has been. Paul Blackburn Rovers for the A's. Jimmy Brandt. I like that. The Escobar move was great, though. Um, you guys had added Ziggler, too, I think. <laughs> Big Boy 7 likes that Walker kid, but thumbs down on those Dodgers. There's out of 99. Why didn't the Giants just trade off everybody, Big Boys 007? I feel like they should have. There's Bregman. Oh, yeah, Tommy Pham left the Cardinals, right? I thought he was going to be there for a while. Did they They should have moved Adam Jones. He might be a, a waiver deal. There's still the waiver deadline, folks. So there's the non-waiver trading deadline where everything's just... Open, open game. And then there's the waiver trading deadline. Oh, yeah, Diekman, too. That's right. Giovanni Gallegos 
for the Yankees. Chris Archer to the Pirates was. I thought the Brewers were a, were a, a great candidate to get the to get Chris Archer. It's good for Scope to be out of the the out of Baltimore. That's true, Eric Jennings. But I don't know if it was well. His his, his average and his his slash line will be fine. I feel like he'll be okay. He's still hitting for power, and that's one of the rare things for him as a second baseman. But there's another Marlin, Garrett Cooper for Jeremy Tillman. Um, I, like what's going on with uh. I, where are they going to play everybody? I feel like there's there's a lot of um, a lot of uh, I don't know, redundancy. Where, where's Travis Shaw going to go? Because they got Moose at third. Um, they got Moose at third. They got Travis Shaw. They got to put Travis Shaw somewhere. They're Starling Castro at two ninety nine. They got got to put Scope somewhere. They they were talking about putting Scope at shortstop. I don't know if that makes sense. I don't know if he's played shortstop since the minor leagues. All right, two boxes to go. Oh, is that right, Joe? I didn't. Re I love it. the trading deadline stories are actually really cool. Joe's like Joe P saying funny that Diegman put us out in the ninth inning of the game the night before. Then the next day, he's on the Diamondbacks. That's pretty funny. It's crazy. Now, Tyler O'Neill. Oh, so Eric Jennings saying Tommy Famgon opens up a spot for Tyler O'Neill. Ton. That's how he signs his cards, ton, T-O-N. But he was a Mariner. How did he end up on the Cardinals? I forgot what move that was. <laughs> Joe P says he rode the, uh, Deakman put the, rode the bullpen cart to the other locker room. Nice. Why aren't, I want to see more people, I want to see more people use that bullpen cart. I think everyone should have a bullpen cart. Really? First Diamondbacks pitcher to use that new bullpen cart this year? I feel like more more people have to use that. So Redmond saying yes. Okay, so Shaw is going to be at second. And Scope at shortstop. How how many times is I don't think Scope has played very much shortstop since the minor leagues, if at all. On that Orioles team. For obvious reasons. All right. Next box, next five autographs. And Big Boy Zello 7 is like Pence is gone, Kutch is gone. At least the Giants, you know, there's so many teams that are tanking. Giants could have easily just tanked. But they added pieces. I, I, you got you to gotta give them that. Okay, so Redmond saying Scope has never played shortstop. I think he did in the minors. Early in the minors, low level. But I think, uh, yeah, I don't think, he must have played at least a few times in the majors. But yeah, pretty much never played shortstop in baseball. And Shaw has never played second base? Hmm. I'm not sh quite sure what, I mean, I guess if you're going to try to add a bat like that, it's good. Another Miguel Andujar. For Patrick K, nice. At a four ninety nine, he's been a nice revelation for the Yankees. There's Tim Beckham, out of one fifty. Who who was saying that? Uh, was it? It's Chase who was saying that the Orioles will will win the World Series in twenty sixty two. Who said that? Oh, yeah, it was Chase. Our new employee, Big Boy 007, helping me drop links to frequently asked questions.
I thought the Nationals were definitely going to trade Bryce Harper and then try to sign him back in the offseason. What were moves that you guys were surprised didn't get made? I thought Adam Jones would go, right? I thought the Giants would move those guys. There's Ryder Jones for the Giants, speaking of the Giants. That goes to Jonah. And I'm not sure about Pudge's kid in any of these sets. When was he drafted? Oh, yeah, Yankees picking up Zach Britton. I almost forgot about that. Nice Tyler Maley. I thought the Reds would maybe move. I thought the Reds would maybe move uh, Rice Ale Iglesias. I don't think he went anywhere, right? Or did he? I don't think he did. I don't think I saw anything like that. Yeah, that Yankees bullpen is kind of crazy. Redmond saying he was surprised that uh, Degrom didn't get moved. Yeah, you would think. I don't know. Yeah, you would think yeah, you would just say, hey, forget it. You know, let's trade DeGrom. Let's try to maybe even Cindergard. You know, they just got to get out from under those bad contracts and try to rebuild that farm system. That's true. Yeah, you're right, Joe P. Mets probably did want too much for DeGrom. Probably didn't work out. Oh, Matt Harvey. Yeah, you know what? I think Rory was also mentioning that the other, uh, maybe yesterday or so, sometime yesterday. He was just like, because I think, I think the Brewers were maybe looking to shore up that starting rotation. They were thinking a little Matt Harvey. So what? What do the Reds need with Matt Harvey? I mean, he can't possibly be part of any of their future plans. You know, try to move him and keep building that farm system. Brewers have decent prospects. Got some solid guys. All right, last box, everybody. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, Jose, I'm watching the, the Dodgers-Brewers game on MLB game day right now. Looks like Brian Dozier singling on a line drive to left field. Bottom of the seventh, man on, no out. I need Ballinger maybe needs to heat up a little bit here. I'm not sure what's next, Arthur. I see a ton of orders after this break. Maybe I think that Premier might have sold out. That was super close. I don't know what else is moving. What else is selling out, ladies and gentlemen? 12 orders. Someone must be buying something. All right, last box, last five autographs. Good luck, everybody. Thanks for joining the break. We've got more of this in the store, so check it out. So the hockey is gone. Anything else moving? Maybe that Leaf Greatest Hits we can work on tonight? There's Parker Bridwell. Every time I see an Angels pitcher, <laughs> Adam, I'm just like, Ota oh. Maybe he's a redemption in this too. There's Justin Turner. Nicky Delmonico. And there's Curie Maya. That goes to the Reds. You want me to break all night? It's Chase. If you, people keep buying all night, then yeah, maybe we could break all night. Another redemption. Walker Bueller, maybe? Any guesses on that redemption? There's Will Myers at a 299. <laughs> I should have just brought a, a pillow and a blanket. Just take just take a quick uh just take a quick like two hour power nap, wake back up and just be like, alright, here we go. Let's break again.
sell something out while I take a nap? <laughs> if John John Samuelson, if that's a Donovan Mitchell or R. Joshua Dobbs redemption, I'll give it to you. There's Brian Anderson. A lot of Marlins auto, at least in this particular case. That goes to JT. Did I skip an auto? Unbelievable. Yeah, yeah, I know. Harrison Bader autograph. It's kind of hard to see, actually. Oh, so people are paying attention. Just want to make sure you guys are paying attention. Just want to make sure you guys are paying attention. You guys are. Brent, paying attention. Nino, paying attention. Patrick K, Rays fan. Garrett, Ryan Redman, Chase. Good. Just making sure that you guys were paying attention. Darth Bader going to Jeremy Tillman and the Cardinals. It is the master, Rich. It's a family show, Rich. Easy, on a 99. All right, there you go. I'm sure a shipping team would have found it. Out of 99, Green Wave, Chris Davis for Jimmy Brandt. We got the Will Myers. We got the Nikki Delmonico. And we've got this guy. Superstar sensation autograph. Super fractor parallel. Dustin Hughes was asking if there's anything amazing out of Chrome. Yes. What superstar? Watch, there's no name. K. Chris Davis? Chris Bryant? Chris Bryant. Wow. Chris Bryant, Superstar Sensation Autograph, Super Fractor Parallel. That is for EA Sports. It's in the game and the Chicago Cubs. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. JaspiesHobbyland.com, home of the big hits. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye. Oh, no. We got this. That, too. I almost left. Making sure you guys are paying attention. All right. Let's go back to the list. There's the list. There's random.org. Let's roll the dice. Let's get a blank list. Let's get everyone's names. Uh, Curtis, like, what do you think they do for a, a sub, a substitution on a super fracture? No, that's probably, that's probably already assigned actually. They're like, hurry up, Chris. All right. Let's roll the dice. Name on top gets the, uh, dog days of summer promo spot eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time after eight times. It's Patrick K. There you go, Patrick. Congrats. Aren't you in the promo already? No, this is your first spot. All right. <laughs> it doesn't matter. It would be nice if you did. Uh, <laughs> congrats to you, Patrick. Oh, you you got the Yankees in this one. That was a nice break for the Yankees, too. And once again, the Chris Bryant for EA. There you go, man. You're welcome. Nice stuff out of jazzpiecehobbyland.com. Home of the big hits. We'll see you next time, folks. Bye-bye.